filmmakers, Emily Skye here, aka She Will Films. Thank you so much for tuning in today. Today I am going to be talking about Think Tank. When they contacted me to do a review on this bag line, I was like, sure. I haven't heard of them before they sent it to me and I'm so happy that they reached out because let's just talk about how aesthetically pleasing everything is, but most importantly, it really protects your gear and what I like about the bag right off the bat is that it doesn't look like a camera bag. You know when you're using a Pelican at the airport, it looks like a cam it looks like a piece of equipment. It looks like you're carrying a camera. But this it's a little more camouflaged as far as you know it's not screaming at you saying, "Hey, I'm a camera bag, take me." It's also light. I like that it's light. It's not as heavy. And another thing I really like is the handle. So some of you may not think it's a huge deal, like having a really awesome handle, but in the Pelican you have to like snap it out and then pull it and it's like really just not easy to push around. It's really uncomfortable. But this is really smooth. It's actually really nice how it moves around. I like it. I'm already a fan of just that alone. So let's go ahead and take a look inside why I think this is really cool. So, this is what it looks like inside. You can put your batteries or any of your little memory cards in here, whatever you please. It's really nice and organized. This is a nice little flap, so you can put your red inside it. It fits really nicely in here, as you can see. It has great compartments for your lenses. You can also structure this to fit your lenses in any kind of gear that you're using. It easily comes in and out so you can actually like form it to your stuff and it's not just, you know, stationed where you can't move anything around. So it's pretty cool. Got the monitor here. So I'm really overall like I think this is really great. I'm pretty happy with it. I'm really excited to use it in my travels for season 2 of Bender Stash because that's what I'll be using um, when I'm traveling. I'll be using this. I'm also a huge fan of the book bag line, the urban bag. I have my camera, my DSLRs in here. I got my Canon. My Lumix actually is filming this. So, hi Lumix, yeah, you're looking at me. But usually, she would be in here too. So it's really nice. It's got a space for my laptop too, which is back here. Put your laptop back here. It's really nice, or an iPad. It's got some good compartments. And what I really like about this bag too is let's close this first before I put it up. Is that you? It has a special little thing right here, so you can move it around. Yes. So I hope you like the review. I like to keep them short and sweet and why I liked it. I, again, it's aesthetically pleasing. It doesn't scream, hi, I'm a camera bag, steal me. So it's a little more camouflaged when traveling, which I think is so important because you don't want people to be like, oh, yeah, that's a camera in there. It's like a $100,000 equipment you know, piece. It, it's, it's nice that it doesn't look like it's carrying your children in it. Basically, I call my cameras and any kind of equipment my children because they kind of are like children. You gotta take care of them, right? And protect them so that no one steals them. So, it also got a really nice airport lock on here too so that you could take it around for security. So overall, yeah, guys, this is a great piece of luggage you guys came out with. I'm really excited to bring this on my traveling whiskey show which I will do a review on that and see how it does traveling, but pretty sure it's gonna do really great already. I'm in love. So thanks for sending it to me. For those of you that wanna learn more about Think Tank, go ahead and click the link. It's gonna be down below in the comments or whatever you wanna call it. So yeah, have a great day, everyone. Thanks for tuning in. Check them out. Pretty excited. Have a fantastical week.